Should have been us, Halo fans. Should have been us. Hello there, everyone. Welcome to my Fallout Episode 2 reaction. I'm going to keep this intro very short since we have a whole show to finish. Very, very pleased with what we had in the premiere. It felt like Fallout. It looked like Fallout. It sounded like Fallout. And it was just overall a good show in general. That's what made The Last of Us such a great show. It's a good show on its own, whether or not you knew it was based off a video game. But it was also a good faithful adaptation and i really hope the rest of the show follows in suit with how well episode one was because i'm really worried it's not gonna hold up and i'm pretty sure it will because i do know the people who worked on it were also passionate about this project passionate about the world of fallout just like i am so with all that being said please stand by Is this the Halo 4 trailer? Uh. Into <laughs> oh, he's a doctor, bro. Young Clave. Dog me. Oh, dude, the laser rifle, bro. Ooh, is that Super Mutant? FEV? Oh, look at the dog on the. Oh. It's like the 2076. Oh, is he hiding her? That's how he's powering his electricity. Don't tell me that's the FEV, dude. Oh. Hey. Sounds like Star Wars, bro. <laughs> Yo, the sentry guns. Don't worry, it's not that accurate. You'll be okay. What happens when you enter my camp? Clever. <laughs> Clever. I love that. Well done. Oh, Wearing the appropriate shirt. The these beach homes? Or were beach homes? Or is uh, that supposed to be like the Chinese concentration, concentration camps? Hey, is that Mr. Handy? Oh, no. Oh, no. It's an Assaultron, bro. Dude, it's like she's just walking around with the Pit Boy radio on. Oh, I want to see more Pit Boy action. Gotta put the Pit Boy flashlight on. Oh, the Red Roach! <laughs> Gross. Gross, so cool. Damn. That's Crosh Piece. He's cleaning his Cod Piece. That's so funny. <laughs> That you're coming with, bro. <laughs> I mean, can you blame Ty? That's like, that's totally something we do in Fallout. Nah, I'm bored. I'm gonna go over here and just shoot some stuff. Dude, there better not be a death claw in there or something. Cram. You warning him? Dude, don't tell me that's a death claw. So funny to me. Oh, that is not a death claw. Oh, shit. <laughs> 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 Rose a play uh, like a level one player with power armor. He was using bats right there. That's why he took so long. This wasteland fucking sucks. <laughs> you know what you could do with a fucking toaster oven? Do you have any idea? <laughs> Scrap it. Make a lot of things with Give the toaster me a oven. Back. You stupid motherfucker. You know this is all your fault. <sighs> okay, now he's letting you die. Why they would don't you do their fucking job? Why would you? They string you up. Just let him die at this point. He just threatened you. I definitely think he did that to his friend now. I don't blame him. Like, you know, damned if you do, damned if you don't. Couple brothers too. Had a hand as well. She got killed there once. This poor guy. 
The same HUD. Even the sound effects, bro. How do you not hear that coming up on you? You, sir, are a scholar and a gentleman. <laughs> It's just... <laughs> Why are you running like that? I was fucking my chickens. <laughs> okay. Okay. Your way, <laughs> what the fuck? This is the best show. <laughs> I could not ask for a better Fallout show. Wow. It's definitely a Fallout City. Oh, is that the ghoul? <laughs> no, <laughs> no way. Oh. Get back to your fucking room, Barb. <laughs> you just called them out here. Say about the vaults. What? <laughs> that was so... Oh, huh. I'll do it. Damn, why are you mad because someone had it better than you? Well, I told you to get the fuck out of here. Real zig. Oh, I'm excited for this. Yeah, bro is him. But I've been paid a whole lot of caps to provide this man safe caps. transport out of Philly. <laughs> oh, bro, use bats there, 100%. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Dude, they gotta show the mini nuke. Gotta see Fat Man. Pipe gun. You got a hole in your neck. Hmm. <laughs> I'm definitely playing Fallout after this. For the tomatoes. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> Not the dog, bro. <laughs> the junk jet. <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> Doesn't even know what he's doing. Well, I'd say come up here and get me, but it's hard to walk upstairs when you're wearing a 12 You can literally fly. You just saw him head. fly. Oh. Uh, Why? Hey, Daddy's girl. I need you to take Strandy, this man Abraxo. shit in my <laughs> Bro's getting bit. Drive that thing like a fucking shopping cart. <laughs> oh hell no, nah, bro. He's about to get tomatoed, bro. That checks out. Oh god, it's the chicken fucker. The cock fucker. The cock fondler. The cock daddy. The cockle doodle do. Oh raiders. Taking a piss. <laughs> the dog is his now. <laughs> And this man's best friend ain't very loyal. The homie hopper. It's the balloon that flew over Montana. No, you see, I've just taken a cyanide pill. Oh, well, there you go. Uh, my head. Just my head. Yeah, oh, he's gonna put himself in the computer, dude. Yes, McLean. Oh, he knows who she know is? My name? He knew his mom. Or he knew her mom. Probably. Randy's Donuts? L.A. I'd like that even her hair tie is blue. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. <laughs> what a way to end an episode. Ooh. Oh, new outro. Is this LAX?
Well, I'm happy to say that episode two continued to capture the soul of Fallout. Another 10 out of 10 episode. What a roller coaster. So much action, a lot of humor, surprisingly, and like very, like it wasn't even hit or miss humor. I think every single joke pretty much hit. I think it's a very like, over the top kind of humor in a way, but they lean into it so well because that's what Fallout's like. It's, I, I don't get why people like, when they want to adapt something to live action, they want to censor it and make it appropriate for like the viewing experience. And I get that there's some things that are really goofy to translate into like a different media, but you have to understand that the reason we love Fallout is because it's Fallout. You don't need to fix what's not broken. Yes, some things can be told or, you know interpreted differently but if you capture overall narrative the overall story the vibe the themes the everything it's gonna be a good fallout show and that's exactly what's going on here it's good because it's fun good because the acting is great it's good because the cinematography the sound everything's great i don't want to you know beat a dead rad roach or anything all these characters again there wasn't a single plot line that i felt i was boring and I'm genuinely enjoying the hell out of this show. It's just been grinning ear to ear all hour and five minutes. I really hope that that continues on in episode three onwards. I'm not sure how many episodes there are. I think there's seven or eight, but uh, I guess we will find out. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in episode three of Fall. Subscribe to Zang Helios for some more unfreaking believable.